Hi everybody! Want to see the most amazing places of Los Angeles? Follow this video! There is a lot of things to do when you are visiting Los Angeles. In this video you cannot see all, but the most important and popular places of this nice city. I prepared this video in two parts. The first part is about downtown LA and in the second part we go together to discover other areas of this beautiful city. In this video I show you that in Los Angeles some nice activities and visits are free. So you can visit, have fun and save your money. Before everything, the best way to visit Los Angeles downtown area is to rent an electric scooters and have fun. Download the application, scan the barcode, and go! Chinatown If you are interested in Chinese food and architecture, Asian culture and shopping economic products, go to Chinatown for some couple of hours and enjoy there. You can see also the statue of Bruce Lee in Chinatown, LA. Olvera Street El Pueblo is a historic district in downtown Los Angeles that most of the people speak Spanish. If you like Mexican food and Latino culture, here is your place. Walking through Olvera Street brings you to the ambiance of Mexican markets. Another interesting spot in El Pueblo is the old fire station of Los Angeles. Little Tokyo is the heart of the largest Japanese American population in North America since 1942. Little Tokyo is the best place to discover Japanese culture, products and food. The last bookstore. If you want to visit the biggest California bookstore, go to Last Bookstore, which is situated in the building of an old bank. Here you can also walk through the book tunnel. Even you can go inside the old vault, which is full of books now. Angel Flights is a funicular with two cars running opposite directions by cables on an inclined railway of 91 meters. The ride costs a dollar for each way. If you have LA Metro Pass, the ride is 50 cents for each way. Grand Central Market is a big food court at the heart of LA. Central Market exists since 1917 and brings together the cuisines and cultures of LA. Here you can find all kinds of foods, Mexican, Asian, Italian, fast food, pastries and a lot of other things. The Bradbury is a famous 19th century building. This five-story building is famous for its extraordinary walkways, stairs and elevators. Many famous movies have been recorded here. The Broad is a contemporary art museum and the best place to see the modern art, paintings, statues and much more. The museum offers free general admission to its permanent collection galleries but you have to reserve in advance your free ticket online. Walt Disney Concert Hall After visiting the Broad, you go just across the street and see this monument with its unique architecture and beautiful gardens. Los Angeles City Hall is a white high building and one of the best photo spots in downtown LA. The visit is free and you can access to a high observation deck and see all parts of the city. Even you can see the Hollywood sign in a good weather conditions. Sky Space of US Bank Tower In this building you can try the glass slide, which is outside of the building between 70th and 69th floors. 
There is also an observation deck for taking stunning pictures of Los Angeles, especially during the sunset. Farmer's Market is a big market of foods, groceries, restaurants, shopping, and also big brands. There is also an old style truly bus like the old times and guess what? The ride is free! Light and Los Angeles County Museum of Art is the largest art museum in western United States. Urban Light is next to the museum and it's composed of 202 street lamps arranged in a near grid. For taking better pictures, try to go there after sunset. Other useful information about the Urban Light is the visit is free. Grammy Museum is an interactive museum. You can play your music, sing a song, see the past winners, and all about the music world. After visiting downtown LA, let's go out of this area to see other interesting spots. Santa Monica is a seaside town with white sandy beach on West California with a famous pier which is the official endpoint of historic Route 66. On Santa Monica Pier, there is a lot of things to do. Seafood restaurants, Ferris wheel, amusement park, juggler shows, live music, taking pictures at the end of the day, and swimming. At Santa Monica, you can also visit 3rd Street Promenade, which is a nice street for shopping, have a drink, enjoy the music, and street performance. Hollywood sign is an iconic place to visit when you are in Los Angeles. The best moment for visiting Hollywood sign is early in the morning. Finding a parking in this area is really difficult. Universal Studio Hollywood is the main amusement park in Los Angeles. It's fun for the whole family. Take the legendary studio tour that put you inside some of the world's biggest movies. Enjoy the rides, Stunmaster shows and all kinds of action activities. Walk of Fame is one of the special places that you should visit when you are in Hollywood. It comprises the names of more than 2,600 stars in the sidewalks of Hollywood Boulevard. Griffith Observatory is a public observatory and visitors can see stars through telescopes. You can also see best views of Los Angeles, taking pictures and have fun. The best part? Admission is free. During the weekend, it's difficult to find a parking.
Thank you very much for watching this video. If you know any other places of Los Angeles that I didn't put in this video, you can just mention them in the comments. By subscribing to this channel, liking the videos and sharing them with your friends, you are supporting me to make more videos for you. Thank you so much and see you next time.